In the next 10 years, compound semiconductor will be the key in different all kinds of industries. Here in the compound semiconductor innovation zone, you can see the compound semiconductors such as gallium nitron and silicon carbide being used on numerous applications, especially in our daily lives. I do appreciate that uh, semicon really bring the Taiwan's uh, IC technology into the pinnacle in the uh, in the world. I would say, okay, nowadays we can continue this kind of mentality in the IC manufacturing as well as the uh, very leading technology development, and then move it into uh, the, we call it the wideband semiconductor or compound semiconductor in the future. Because Taiwan has all the key ecosystem existing in Taiwan today. Um, we've seen um, many design wins in onboard charger, um, DC to DC converter, um, traction inverter, um, the all-GAN car that Toyota um, developed and launched a couple of years ago um, is a great example um, of, of GAN in, in, the, in the electric vehicle. And there are many other applications beyond that as well. Um, so Class D audio, for example, um, LiDAR, um, wireless charging in the cabin. Um, and all of these applications require the same thing. They, they require they require higher efficiency and faster switching speed, which then deliver smaller, lighter weight systems, um, which is which is exactly what the electric vehicle requires. As you may know, that Unicom is from spring up from AB Star, so we are really good at uh, optical devices. So of course, Unicom delivers a platform for micro LED. This is our specialty. Okay, both for, not only for micro LED, we also provide uh, devices for Vixel, for data communication and uh, like uh, 3D sensing. Okay, furthermore, we will deliver LiDAR platform for EV. Oh, this is our specialty. This is Semicon Taiwan, our platform is the uh, 